It's the Blazing Hot Praise Top 40 Countdown with William Murphy. He's got our number 16 song this week. It's called Everlasting God. Hey, stick around. Number 15 is next. It comes from Dietrich Haddon and the Hill City Worship Camp. It's called A Billion People. That's coming up right after the break here. Hey, let's just go back quickly to number 25, if you're just tuning in. It came from an artist by the name of Ruth Leantra with Kingdom. Number 24 is uh, Charles Jenkins featuring Leandra with Grace. Number 23, Anthony Evans with See You Again. Number 22, Wes Morgan with Get Me Through. Number 21, Anita Wilson with I've Seen Him Work. Number 20, Cheryl Fortune with Fighters. And number 19 is John P. Key, along with his New Life Community Choir and Miranda Curtis. She's a solo artist now out of Dallas, Texas, and it's called Release. Good afternoon. Uh, good afternoon. Uh, <laughs> you, you put me on the spot. I put you on the spot. Yes, How are you did. doing? <laughs> I'm wonderful. How are you doing? Now? I'm good. Of course, that's the song. illustrious voice of the man, the myth, the legend, <laughs> Pat. <laughs> Pastor Wayne Dandridge, how are you doing today? I'm not the man. I'm not a myth. <laughs> I'm not a legend. I'm still alive. <laughs> you could be a legend and still be living. Well, I'm okay. definitely not a myth. I'm See? real. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, if you look at it that way. Well, what's happening? It's a beautiful Saturday. Yes, it is. And, and, and you're doing a great job with uh, your uh, Blazing Hot Praise. But I just want to let the listeners know, you know mm -hmm. that the uh, Blazing mm -hmm. Hot Praise Top 30 is on the website. Yeah, we told them last week. Yeah. And you can see the video. See the video. That's so wonderful. So we update that every week. Mm -hmm. and, uh, we had it changes every week. Yeah. Right, right. <laughs> so you'll have to change it. You gotta change it every week. It's a lot of work, but it's, someone it's has to do work, it. Yeah. <laughs> I was looking at the top twenty four uh, mm -hmm. quartet. Yes. And uh, one group went from number fourteen to number nine. Well, that happens. You yes. can take a jump I mean, like that. That was a good jump. Yeah, that's I a think, good jump. I've seen jumps on. Yes, the top you can go from number. You can debut at number twenty-seven <laughs> next week. You're number five. Right. You know, so it just depends on how hot the song is. Right. But you know what? This week, I'm glad you brought that up. The gospel news. I'm talking about the Southern Suns. The Southern Suns. Yeah. And they used to be at number one. And now they are. They're number two. Okay. Well, see, they're hot. That's why I had to talk yes. about them. You know, Bob. Hey, Bob. You know. I Bob remember. Holloway. Now yeah, in that's my boy. Yeah. That's my boy. Um, I might see Bob in uh, Atlanta. Yeah, you probably will see them yes. all in Atlanta. Yes. Don't brag about going. I'm, I'm not just bragging. so I'm tired just, of you. I'm, but. <laughs> It's a struggle, but somebody's got to do it. Yes. Send the legendary ones down there. Um, but I'm talking about Keith Wonderboy Johnson also. Oh, okay. Yeah. Because he's, he's had a tremendous year. Yes. You know, he took home the Stellar for right. uh, Best Quartet mm -hmm. this year. So I'm glad. And everybody was mad because he did that. Well, well you know, not, he's been mad because he hasn't been winning all along. Right. I remember I talked to him about it. He said, it's political. I'm like, what does that mean? You know? <laughs> I said, Keith, don't be bitter. It's uh, just not your year. He just did a remake <laughs> of some of his songs, too. On his last, that, well, yeah. yeah. He probably said, well, nobody heard him, so I can do <laughs> <them> again. again. <laughs> yeah, you can do that. You can mm -hmm. do that. Mm -hmm. It's your songs. Bring do them out of it. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's great. So, you know, my friend um, in Baltimore, Jermaine Mickey, mm -hmm. he has a, a show like yours, and he says, why come you don't never talk about quartet people? I said, I do. Wait a minute. Did you just say... Why come? Why come? That's what he said. <laughs> I'm quoting him. Why come? He Why said, come? That's what he said. Why come you don't he's never talk definitely about definitely down the south. Yeah, he's by way of, we're not going to get into it. But he, <laughs> he's living in Baltimore now, and he's doing this thing there. And I said, I do. I, I said, you know what? You're right. Mm -hmm. Let's, so this week, it's all about, we're talking about Shirley Caesar. And uh, I did add Donnie McClurkin in there because he's having a tremendous year. And mm -hmm. I'm so tired of him on per Periscope every other right. minute. He's in yes. Australia. I'm like, this is a world travel. Who's at the church? Right. You, know? <laughs> you, got, you see why you got to have those backup people at the church, them. especially yeah. if pastor's an artist. You got to have like 12 backup people yeah, for him. Norfolk. Yeah. He's a pastor. He's yes. An Marvin Sapp, yes. pastor, artist, John P. Key, pastor, artist, yes. Marvin Wyden, that means that pastor, you, artist. Yes. 
and they they're everywhere still. So I want like, a good friend of mine from um, Pine Bluff from from um, Arkansas. Pine Bluff, Arkansas. I think it's, well, it's not. It might not be Pine Bluff. I've heard of that. Armando Adams. Armando. Armando Adams in the group Redemption. He's a pastor. Too. He is a pastor. Yes, he's. Oh, they've been to Columbus before. Really? Yes. Praise yeah. Rejoice George Productions bought them here years ago. Years ago. Years See, that's ago. why you're the legendary. Whatever. But. <laughs> Oh, that, you know, we need a big quartet concert. We really Definitely. Do. A big one. Jackie, do you hear that? Jackie? Jackie. Oh, yeah. I didn't <laughs> know Jackie was a promoter. Oh. Yeah. I just remember seeing her graduate from high school, you know, <laughs> just these kids these but, days, yeah, they're she's, doing uh, it. She's into promoting. A big now. one, yeah. A big mm -hmm. one. A great big one, you so, know. Yes. That's she's playing on something right now. Good, she's good. She's got something in the works right now. She hasn't. Um, finalize everything and that's why no one's heard anything about it of yet, course not i know we'll be the first yes, i yes, hope we will be the first. <laughs> we will be the first we better be yes really <laughs> niece right don't act crazy right <laughs> all right well i'm going back to all my office and going back to work hey do your thing but thanks for stopping by and giving us uh, the update you know you should do that often you know come in and give us the uh, quartet updates because we want to know what's happening, not only with, with well, all you, the gospel music. Well, since you want to know, yes. you know who's number one now? Who? George Dean and the Gospel Four. Who are they? <laughs> George Dean and you know what? I Lee think I Williams have, yeah. used to be, I mean, well, they are still, but they were uh -huh. label mates years ago. With who? Uh, e and J Records. Okay. Oh, that's when, that's when Lee Williams wasn't even known. Yeah. And Lee Williams came to the quartet convention in Birmingham, Alabama mm -hmm. and exploded. Very quietly and very subtly, right. I'm sure. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and then George Dean followed right behind him. Really? Yeah, so okay. He, he's up there now. His uh, new album is uh, Getting My Business Straight. Mm -hmm. Yes. And that's number one this week. Yes, number one. That's awesome. The title track. Well, you know what? I am with the gospel news. I'm going to keep up on all there the industry go. news, including the quartet, including everything, all mm -hmm. all across the board. And then, then somebody will call me and say, "How come you don't do gospel hip hop?" You know. And then they say, "How come you don't do local artists?" Is that, see, <laughs> you see what I mean? You right. can't please everybody. But I'm only going to keep up on the national because the gospel big. news, as you know, is international. Yes, it is. It's not local, so <laughs> got to keep up on what's international. You're the legend. I I'm the legend. Yes, right? you're, you're all over I'm the trying, world. You're the legend. <laughs> I'm trying to make it there. You know. You got to broadcast all the way over in London, England. Well, you well, know, see you know. God see you is good. <laughs> hey. I'm gone. Hey. Bye. <laughs> Well, thank you. Of course, that was Reverend Wayne Dandridge. You can catch him tomorrow on the uh, the Gospel Quartet show. It's from 6 to 10 p.m. It's called uh, Praise and Quartet. He does that all evening long on Sunday, each and every Sunday night. You can catch it here tomorrow night. Well, we'll get back to the countdown in minutes right after this.